Doctor, doctor, my willy's not working. Oh, terribly sorry to hear that, ma'am. Uh, keep a stiff upper lip about it. But I don't want a stiff upper lip, doctor. Men, we need to talk about erectile dysfunction. I'm Dr. Andy Knox, I'm a GP, Director for Health and Wellbeing in Morecambe Bay, and we're gonna talk about our willies today. Listen, first thing, erectile dysfunction is really common. It will affect probably every single man at, in the whole world at some point in their life. So, let's get it out in the open. I don't mean you willy, I mean the subject, and let's talk about it and stop being embarrassed about it. Because um, actually, we see hundreds and thousands of men in the NHS struggling with erectile dysfunction every single year. The second thing is, actually, you need to talk about it because the little man, or big man if you're lucky, uh, downstairs might be telling you something that's underlying going on. So there are lots of different causes for erectile dysfunction. One of them is that you're under a lot of stress. And it might be that we need to help you think about how to deal with that better. You might want to see a coach or uh, get some counselling or whatever, or think about how you're spending your life. It could be that you're struggling with a mental illness like depression or anxiety, something else that men aren't particularly good at talking about. It might be that you're developing something like diabetes or high blood pressure, or that you are um, having a problem with your nervous system or your prostate. It might be that you're struggling with an emotional problem like guilt or shame. Actually, there are lots of different things that could be going on and it's worth us checking those things out. The third thing, interestingly to remember, is that actually about one in every 10 people who think that they're struggling with erectile dysfunction are in fact just squeezing their jizz too early. Premature ejaculation. So you're getting your erection but it's not lasting very long because you're ejaculating too quickly. So we can think about that. It might feel a bit embarrassing when we ask you those questions, but actually it's just a normal part of life. Sex is a really important part of any relationship. And the fourth thing to remember is that actually this is really treatable. There's lots of stuff that can help. Either we treat the underlying condition or we can give you medication, which actually you can buy really cheaply over the counter these days from a pharmacist um, to actually help you achieve an erection and enjoy sex again. So let's not be embarrassed about this issue. Let's make sure there's not an underlying issue. Let's make sure we're treating the right issue and then let's actually sort out the issue. Okay, men, come on. Let's talk about erectile dysfunction and let not it be a massive issue for us. Hope you find that helpful.